This video is to demonstrate how to run the League Bowlers email report in WinLabs. We'll start by going to Reports, select Association, General, and go down to League Bowlers email. Notice a lot of the criteria within this report looks very similar to our League Bowlers report. For instance, we select active, inactive, or both types of bowlers. We can narrow the criteria down by gender or age. If you are running this for marketing purposes for a center or for the association, you'll need to exclude bowlers who don't share member information to protect their privacy. As they've indicated earlier on, they're not interested in marketing material. Click Next. Here we can narrow this down by one league, all leagues, all leagues in one center. We'll run this as though we are doing this for a center's marketing purposes. So we'll mark in one center and select our center. Click Next. If you're running the report based on the year of average, here's where you would change that information. If you need all of the bowlers and not just those with 21 games or more in their average, you can change this number to one and select the season you're looking for. Again, this area just shows the selection criteria on the report itself. If you're not interested in that showing, you can remove that option. Here on Output Options, this is where you'll select if you want it in standard report format for either a printout or an export, or if you're looking to do mailing labels. If you are looking to do mailing labels, here's your margins area where you can change your settings to make sure that your labels are lining up when they print. We'll go ahead and preview. Here's our report with all of the bowlers, narrowed down with the criteria we entered and their email addresses. From here, you can either just print the report, or if you're looking to generate an email list so you can do a blast, you'll click Export and select the file type that the program requires. For this demonstration, we'll use Excel. Save the file to our desktop, and now we just wait for Excel to open. Notice there's gonna be information in here that we won't need. We can highlight the header, by clicking on it and then holding down the mouse key, drag your mouse across all of the top headers of the columns that you're not going to need. Then right click on the mouse and select delete to remove those columns. Looking in our list, you'll notice there are some people who do not have email list, emails that are listed. So we'll go ahead and highlight the two columns move over here and select sort and filter and go down to filter okay you'll notice that it gives us drop down arrows at the top of each of the columns on column b where your emails are listed you'll click on that arrow down here in the selection criteria box you'll scroll to the bottom remove the check mark out of the blanks box and click ok and you'll notice it removes all of the bowlers who did not have email addresses. Now we can come up here to File, go down to Save As, and we can save our new email list. I always recommend saving to your desktop to ensure you can locate the file easily. You can always move it later on. Go ahead and click Save. Since we did save this initially to the desktop as we were exporting from WinLab, we will want to click OK to go ahead and replace that file since we have made changes to it. This demonstration was to show you how to run an email list as well as the League Bowlers with email report in WinLabs.